Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been <laughs> forever, it feels like, and I just needed a break. That's it. <laughs> so I'm gonna do another palette, Bingo, using Project Pan palettes. So, so here we go. And I tell you what I have used, so hopefully I don't get like a repeat. And I haven't tried um, for this week or the second time to face pumpkin palette, so I'm glad I'll be using that palette. So happy. That was a really good palette. Let's see if it's still good. <laughs> the second chance, choice, chance of it. And here's another Project Pan palette. Let's see if I get a new palette and Morphe X Jeffree Star. So those are the two palettes I haven't used yet. I know I used the pumpkin to face one once and this one I haven't used yet. So awesome. Love the choices. Here's the first pick. Too Faced Pumpkin Spice Palette in very beautiful color story. I really do like it. I like how colorful it is. And the Jeffree Star Morphe Palette. And that's what it looks like. A lot of neutral, but a pops of color here and there. Pretty nice. One through 18. Four. 12, 16, and 1 through 30, 17, 7, 15. Not the best swatching because I did it on the other hand. I usually do it on this hand, but it's on this one. So it is pretty fallish look. Not my favorite, but oh well. I like, you know, this very reddish tone. I love this color. So it'll be interesting to create a look and it's all matte. <laughs> Going in with Lynn. It's funny because that's my middle name. I think it's pretty common middle name. What do you think? So I'm just gonna go in with all over for a base because it is the lightest color and I don't know where else to put this color in a color story. So going in with Love You Latte, this one right here. I swatched, all the colors swatched beautifully. So I'm going in in the crease area. I'm a little higher. Going in with Warm and Cozy, this one. Okay, going in the outer portion. Might have to build that up a little bit. It is a little dusty in the pan. I'm just going in just like that. Going in with Calabasas right here. <laughs> this is such a big palette. Um, but I love big palettes. Don't get me wrong. I love big palettes because I love the color story. And going in with Calabasas right next to the color I just did. Like right in the center. Since it is, you know all mattes it's gonna be hard <laughs> to figure out what i want like right here and then right there i guess so adding more of calabasas i'm going in with pumpkin spice i'm excited because such a pretty color swatch to in in the pan so pumpkin spice it is Going in the inner portion, and I'm going to put it all the way right here as well. It's such a pretty color. It 
it is pumpkin-y. Now the last is a Los Angeles right here. So going in with that all the way down here in that lower lash line. So it's the only shade that's left. So just going all the way across. So far, I am not liking this. <laughs> I'll hopefully mascara and maybe black eyeliner underneath in the waterline. Um, we'll fix it up better and then I just gotta fix the under here. It'll be good. That's what it's looking like. And here is the finished product. <laughs> I, I kind of like it even more and now it's put together. By the way, I did dishes and that's what happened when you wash knives in my house. <laughs> if you got like the Pioneer Woman, they're really sharp from Walmart. Oh my gosh. And then a little accident <laughs> with mascara. Trying to put the mascara one back in and just totally skip the hole. Anyways, that's the color story. And this is the finished look. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel. Bye for now.